Good morning, guys. Um, the my hair is a little crazy. I just blow dry, blow dried it, and didn't have time to strain it. But Pax is just falling asleep for his one nap. He kept falling asleep in his crib, but like waking himself up. Um, but he's in his swing, sleeping. Well, putting himself to sleep. And he's taking his pacifier. Last night, last night he did not seem to want his pacifier. When he was going to bed at like 7.30, 8 o'clock, he took it for a little while. But then after, like after he fell asleep and it came out, and I nursed him at like 10.30 and then like 12.31 and then 4. He did not want it. He was like every time like I would finish nursing, I would like see if like he'd want it afterwards. He was like making this weird like little disgusting face like mm, like no he did not want it. Like shaking his head, spitting it out. So I was like didn't like force, you know, put it in there. And he said, I feel like if he's going to sleep fine without it, then I just won't put it in. But like nap time, like during the day, seems to be the best time to give it to him because he's more um, awake. Whereas in like middle of the night, he's like pretty much dead asleep. Um, but I wanted to kind of give it to him anyways because I did read that it helps um, decrease the risk of SIDS, whether you know that's true or not. But um, one of the reasons I wanted to give it to him. But he seems to like it a lot more during nap time than at night, um, especially when he's like. Um, not just going to sleep for the first time during the night, but like waking up, if that makes any sense. Waking up and then going back to sleep during the middle of the night. He does not seem to want it at all. But, um, I'm just cleaning. And I just put up a video. Um, I just put up a video. It's Monday. Um, I think I'm going to film today tomorrow which is today's Monday so Monday Tuesday put it up Wednesday and for the last video that I put up for Monday for today um, was Saturday and Sunday and I kind of did like Saturday and said that it was Saturday and then when that clip was finished I put that it was Sunday so leave a comment down below if you want me to do that um, if I don't just film for one day if I film for like Monday Tuesday and put it up Wednesday and then Wednesday Thursday for Friday's video and then Saturday Sunday for Monday's video um, for now and like I said I think I mentioned for like people that ask for like daily vlogs if I'm going to ever do those um as of right now um I don't think so just because I'm going to get I want to get used to um my work routine when I go back to work so when that is like I'm back in schedule and routine of that then maybe I'll consider but right now I'm just going to do I think I'm going to do it just do I think I plan on just doing it like that like film Monday, Tuesday, put up Wednesday, Wednesday, Thursday, put up Friday, Saturday, Sunday, put it up Monday, if that makes any sense. So leave a comment if you want me to caption um, what day it is so you guys can like keep track. But um, right now I'm just sorting through all of Pax's clothes. I'm getting rid of, well not getting rid of, I'm just putting away like his newborn things and a lot of his newborn clothes still fit. Um, especially like the little pants fit him um the onesies like all these onesies are he's just about to be out of them um probably this will be his like last week wearing them but all of his newborn sleepers they're definitely going up in the attic because his feet are too big so he's getting into all of his zero to three month clothing um they're still a little bit big especially the pants because his he is really slender um, he's a little bit long, I mean, not really long, but I guess average, but, um, he's really slender. And I don't know if I showed you guys this, um, in my bridal shower, bridal shower, my baby shower video, but, um, this was part of the thing that everyone did. Everyone either designed a bib or a onesie, and they, these are fabric markers, and they've all been washed and everything, so they don't come off. Um, and everyone wrote their own thing, like, keep calm and feed me. People just drew little pictures on it. Um, munching with Mimi. Obviously, this is from my mom. Um, let's see. This one's cute. Who's hungry? So I thought that was a really, really cute idea. And people did onesies. And, oh, one of the bibs, I'm not sure where it is, but um, it says... Um, someone, some fool put my cape on backwards, which I thought was so funny. And then they did, um, onesies. So I think that's a really, really cute, 
um, baby shower idea. If anyone's planning a baby shower for someone, I think that's really cute. And a lot of people didn't put their names on them, but I wish they put their names on the tag. So I would know who did it, you know what I mean? But that's what I'm doing right now. And also, I wanted to, I'm not sure if anyone is interested in, you know, wanting these. But I have two packs of, well, two half packs of Baby Gannix newborns. And they don't fit packs anymore. And I feel really horrible getting rid of them because they don't fit packs anymore. So, leave a comment down below if you want me to ship you these. I mean, they are open, but, you know, I didn't take them out of the pack or anything. Um, and I'll put them in a, a plastic bag also but leave a comment down below if you want them and i will ship them to you um because i just feel bad getting rid of them so the first person that comments and saying they want them i will definitely ship them to you they're just too small for them that's why we didn't use them and i also want to show you guys something i got in the mail and also leave a comment down below if you are interested in um this is Enfamil. It's a package from Enfamil. Um, I'm going to open it, I guess, just to show you guys what's in it. Um, and plus, because it has my information on it also, on the inside of the package, so I have to take that out anyways, because I don't want my information and everything going with it. But I will open it up and show you guys what's in it. Okay, so I just opened the package up. And if you're interested, again, just leave a comment down below and I would love to ship these to you. Um, and again, I'd rather give them, give them to someone than them go to waste. But this is what they look like. Um, this is Enfamel Newborn and Enfamel Gentle Ease. And then it has four packs of the Instant Formula there and then another pack of um and that's i guess for supplementing and this is this is enfamel infant one i don't really know that much about it because i breastfeed which is why i'm rather give them to someone than you know toss them and then i think it has like what's inside here oh like coupons milestones i guess so all this is in here so again, if you have inf if you use Infamil and you like it, it's the newborn and the gentle ease. The first person that comments and says saying that they that they want it, I will definitely ship this to you. Um, again, I'm breastfeeding, which is why I'm not using it. I had this. I think I got I got this before I even had packs. So it's just been downstairs in our storage. Um, in our like laundry room so I'd rather give to someone but um yeah leave a comment if you want that but all right guys we're gonna finish putting his stuff away straightening my hair and I think um Pax's Nona is coming over today so well this afternoon there he is okay we're going on a walk with Pax say hi Pax and his new beanies did come I don't know you can't even really see them because of the car seats black say hi we're gonna see how long he'll like to be in here because he does not like the <laughs> stroller. That's so unusual. No, I think he just lo <laughs> he just wants to be carried all the time. And maybe because he's used to me carrying him in the ergo. Yeah, I you know. That's it. He's like, Mom, Hello. carry me. We've never strolled him in that here. I think I've strolled him in that one time. Yeah. Yeah, so maybe he'll like this better than like the actual big foot. I know what you think. Huh? We're just oh. hanging out. Look at Pax. That's his um turquoise slouchy hat. Right I say slouchy, I mean right slouch. He's, he's got a, Say hi, Paxton. You tired? Say hey, don't look at me. Don't look at me. He's just playing with his Nona. <laughs> Here he is. Here he is. Looks so cute. Yeah. Are we done with that? And I don't want that. I'm done with that. that. You 
look so cute with that mm. hat on. I like that color hat. Are you, are you a slouch? Now? And they have a color olive green color. That would oh, be really cute pretty. with him. They might even have a mustard color, which would be pretty. Are you a slouch now? <laughs> are you? Are you? Okay, you guys, Rob's mom and sister just left. They were visiting. And Rob's dad is actually here. He just stopped by to um, visit Pax and they met up or whatever. But um, it is 7. What time is it? 7.20 packs fall asleep at 7 o'clock and it's funny because it's like 6.50 you can tell when he just wants to be swaddled and wants to go to bed so I swaddled him fed him and he went to bed at 7 and he's just sleeping in there so he'll sleep in there until like 10 10 30 when it's time for us to go to bed which is perfect because it's a great time because he wakes up to feed and then um, we go to bed so it's nice but today, I made really, really good pumpkin cookies. So look, here they are. And they're supposed to look like messy like that. Here they are. They are so good and like the easiest cookie to make. And it's actually not even a cookie. It's actually like cake, I guess. Really easy to make. All you use is one box of spice cake mix, chocolate chips, however many you want to put in. I usually put like one cup. And um, a can of... Um, pumpkin and I'll show you the can that I use and I use half of it so I use this you do half a can and then I just freeze the rest for next time for another thing I want to do um, use it for but um or you can just use that whole can and use two boxes of pumpkin spice mix and um, spice yeah I think it's pumpkin spice or just spice cake mix and um, more chocolate chips but I made those and I ate I ate a lot and um, Rob's mom ate some and Rob ate some and his sister but they're really really good and they're really moist so it's not like crunchy like a cookie they're like more cake I guess not cake but um it's hard to really explain but try them they're so so good um you just put it on put the oven on 350 Mix all those ingredients together and bake them for like 11 or 12 minutes. I feel I feel like 14 minutes was better. Um, they were ready at 14 minutes, but and there's you don't put any butter or any milk or anything like that or any sugar. It's just half of that can of pumpkin. Um, however many chocolate chips you want, I put a cup and um, spice mix the cake mix, and that's it. Mix it together and you just pop them on the um cookie tray and they don't expand so you can put a lot on the tray um i did like a tablespoon um each of the mix and just put it on there but it's really really good but all right guys i think i'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog for tonight and then i will film more for tomorrow all right guys see ya paxton say good morning youtube Good morning, everybody. Hi. Morning, guys. It is Tuesday, and Pax is exactly eight weeks old. And I want to cry. Last night, um, I was totally crying. Um, I go through these things like, like I get. Oh, I go through these like things and I feel like I'm like more emotional now than I was when I was pregnant. I don't know if it's because he's here now and I know that I'm leaving him soon. Or even when I don't think about leaving him, I just start crying thinking that like he's growing up. I don't know. Um, leave a comment down below if you were like that after you had a baby. Um, or I'll just like, I don't know, I just start crying just thinking like how much I love him and... You know, I don't want this time to pass and everything like that. Um, if you saw, I left a little comment on Facebook and that's when it started happening. When I was just writing about it. Um, but he's going to be two months next week. And that's November 2nd. And I go back November 17th. And let's change the topic because I'm going to start crying again. Um, anyways, today we are going for... We're going to the park, right? We're going to the park day. Yay, for the park. <gasps> Say, I just got fed. I just ate, right? Are you happy now? 
You happy? I'm just deciding what outfit I'm gonna put on him. Um, oh my god, what is that? I'm just deciding what outfit he's going to wear today. If he's going to wear the panda outfit that I showed you guys from H&M with the black and white leggings. It has a matching hat, but I think if I do, if he does wear this, he's going to wear his, his black slouch beanie. Or just a white um, long sleeve with this turquoise beanie and these little pants, which I think are really cute. He's never worn. But I don't know. We're meeting my friends there. I know we're meeting, we're definitely meeting one there. Um, and I asked my one friend who's been wanting to hang out. If she wanted to meet us there, but I haven't heard back from her. Um, she doesn't have a phone, so it's hard to get a hold of her. Um, so I messaged her on Facebook, so I guess it depends if she goes on there, if um, she sees it. Um, I'll, I'll have to text her boyfriend. They were doing tummy time. Say hi. Hi, guys. Did you guys see that cutest picture ever on Instagram yesterday? He looked so stinking cute. It was from yesterday. Well, we went for a walk, but he looked really, really cute. Right? That looks so cute. Give me a thumbs up if you know what I'm talking about. Um, I feel like I was talking to Rob's mom yesterday, and I was telling her, like, I feel that when you have a little boy, you have to try, like, really hard to, like, not make them look cute, but to make them look different than, like, other little boys that are around their same age. Because I feel like with girls, it's like there's so many girl shops and, like, they have so many different kinds of, like, really cute girl clothes like, there's just, I feel like there's way, way more options, especially, like, really cute clothes, you know what I mean? But I feel with boys that it's, like, you're gonna see another baby in the same exact outfit as him because there's not that great of a selection. Like, at Carter's, like, I feel like it's the same kind of stuff. Even though I love Carter's clothes, I think they're so cute. Sometimes I feel like, you know, I don't want them to have, like, every animal on the butt or... The same shirt that I know another little baby is going to have kind of thing. So I feel like with boys you have to kind of try a little harder. Like look for different things that not all other babies have. Which is why I ordered the beanies from Slouch. And I got the bandanas. Because I think they're really cute. And I want to order him some like like these were like these were from H&M. And I think they're super cute. And I want to order more leggings that are different like Aztec um patterns and just like different patterns and colors for him that I know they don't sell at Carter's but and I feel like for boys there's not that many like really good baby stores that have like really cute clothes I guess <gasps> what did you just roll over I missed it well the camera missed it aww we could got it on camera why you do that when I'm not looking when I'm not looking. The YouTube wants to see. YouTube wants to see you. Right? They want to see you roll over. <gasps> Darn. That was so cute. How many time? Whoa. His neck's getting real strong. Wow. He's really like Holding himself up. What is that pose? What is that pose? He's like, yeah, if I could just get myself over here. You are so stinking cute. Trying to push yourself? Not working out like last time? <laughs> He's like, yeah, mom. You know the deal. Whoa! Major spin. Spit up. Spit up, it was too much of a workout, right? Wow. You're trying so hard. You can do it. You can do it. Push yourself. My lord. Go, buddy, go. Yay! You're right. Good. <gasps> you did it, buddy. He is so flipping cute. Like, I can't. And I was like, C G E can't get enough. <gasps> Say hi, guys. Hi, YouTubies. Hi. <laughs> Look at his eyes. We are at the park. 
um, with my friend. We were with uh, my other friend, but she had to go pick up her, whoops, she had to go, that is like a ditch. She had to go pick up her son at school. So we're with my other friend. Her daughter is um, turned one in May. She's at, just walked over to the park. So we're gonna go over there. I was just nursing him. Hi, Deanna. Hi, oh my God. All down my shirt. Are you in your first park? Are you in your first park? Uh, ah, I don't want to talk about it. I don't want to talk about it. Say hi, Pax. Hi, Pax. Hey. Hey. Say hi. All right, guys, we just got home. Um, I didn't really film much of the playground. Um, he was in the ergo a little bit, just sleeping the rest of the time. But um, I'll have to show you guys the hat and bibs that my um, friend got him. It was such a surprise. Um, they're so cute. But Pax is definitely tired. Um, went to the chiropractor after the playground. Um, so he's it's about like 6.30, so he's getting ready to... Um, get ready for bed but look how cute he looks in his little slouch beanie with his little bandana bib but he looks so cute he is so tired I am tired you tubies I'm tired so I'm gonna get him in his pajamas and go and swaddle him beat him and put them to bed. Where are you going to hang out in the swing for a little while? Like you could probably fall asleep right here. <laughs> Bex is putting himself to sleep. Rob is making dinner. And Maddie is biting herself. <laughs> Alright guys, we're going to go ahead and end the vlog. Um, I'm pretty tired. It's like, um, what time is it? It is 6.54 and it feels a lot later, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. sure Rob, it does. Rob was saying that before. It's been feeling late early. So yeah, it gets, it's getting mm -hmm. way darker. I wonder what like countries don't have daylight saving time. Like I know Hawaii doesn't, which is they're so lucky. Um, but leave a comment down below if you don't have daylight saving time. And you're so lucky if you don't because I can't stand it getting a little so dark so early i want to show you guys the stuff that my friend got for packs well she made these two things she made this because she was embroidery machine she made that for him she made this one for him which was super nice so she just surprised me made those and then she bought this one because she knows i love giraffes and before i was even pregnant i'm like not before i was pregnant when i was younger i thought i was going to do my kids room like all giraffes obviously i still love giraffes but not to like that extent that I want to do his whole room. But look how cute this hat is. He looks so cute and I'll have to, when I do a video tomorrow, I'll have to um, film him in it. But alright guys, I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog. Thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I want to say thank you so much to um, all my new subscribers that have been subscribing. It means so much to me. And thank you so much to all my subscribers that have followed me since the very beginning of trying to conceive. It means so much to me and Rob. And Pax is one lucky boy to have so many people that care about him. Alright guys, have a good night. Bye!